First talk we are going to review everybody is Coinbase, it's reporting tomorrow. So if the, if the market stays high like this, you know, towards uh, over the 5,000 area, we know that Coinbase is going to come with very strong earnings, okay? Obviously, I would love to buy back, not buy back, add, because I do have it, add to my position here on the structure of the division lines of 87. So if for any reason, if for any reason they don't like the Coinbase earnings tomorrow and the next few days, this 87 would be a fantastic re-entry. See, it's the bottom of the channel. It's also the rule of third edges right there. So you want to re-enter. I want to see if the long-term calculator tomorrow is going to stay within the next few days, up or down. I'm watching this. And I want to see if the sellers are coming after the earnings. But the ideal entry for Coinbase, right? The ideal entry for Coinbase is 87. The target for Coinbase is going to be uh, uh, number one, 150. And then I have a 210. So 150 on the upside, if they blow up everything after earnings, because everybody and their mothers have been back trading cryptocurrency since November. So their quarterly results should be pretty good. And it shows that we still have on the look back period of two years, a 54, 55% uh, left on, on Coinbase. So Coinbase could go hit the 150, work its way to the 210 new high for the year, and then we will reassess the target. I want to stay in what the calculators and the probability calculator shows you now, not what you think it's going to do in the next 10 years. Right now, I have 87, 150, 210 as a realistic swing trading and long-term investing range for Coinbase. 